I was going through some posts from my previous videos and I found that uh, people are really interested in how to set up the video output from an x68000 and uh, put it on your PC or maybe on a projector. So today I would like to talk to you about the PCAST. Uh, this is this is uh, an, uh, a, a device made by the company Buffalo. Um, this is actually a scan converter that converts um, VGAs or uh, VGA signals from a PC, uh, in this case an X68000, and it can convert it to um, the analog RCA output. Uh, which is a composite video and also S video. Uh, the most cool thing about this device is that um, it supports uh, horizontal and vertical frequencies uh, starting from uh, 15 kilohertz to um, I guess 41 kilohertz. So that falls into all the range for the X68000 and it supports x68000 flawlessly i mean it, i've tried so many things with the x68000 and uh, i even tried to put that signal into my frame meister directly but uh, it doesn't work that well but uh, when i put the s video out from the pcast into my frame meister and i connect the output of my frame meister here into an HDMI splitter and the splitter is connected to my 720p projector DLP projector I get an amazing result on the screen now you must be seeing some red green and blue lines but um, that is not visible to me it's only visible to my cell phone camera so let me show you how this works the output of the X68000 uh, is being converted from uh, that RGB 15 port to the VGA port uh, and then it is being fed into the PCAST and the PCAST is sending out the S video and that video is being fed into the frame meister and then the frame meister has been connected to my projector. Uh, I'm sorry for this mess, but this is actually my my junkyard room where I do all my mods and all my videos also as well. <laughs> Anyways, so let's turn out lights. Hmm. I hope something is visible. Yep. So now let's play some Akumajo Dracula. I've burned the image of Akumachu Dracula to floppy disks, so I will just put them in. Gotta love these 5 inch floppies. I hope these are the correct ones, and I turn this thing on. As soon as I turn this thing on, Okay, the floppies are now being read and let's see what we have here okay we're trying to adjust to the signal floppies are being read we have the music Love that music.
very nice floppy ejected and the disc one gets ejected and we see the konami logo we loved it now it is again resyncing to the new video there we go The picture is amazing. I mean, it's really amazing. And you, uh, the red, green, and blue lines that you are seeing is actually not visible to my eyes. It's only because it's a DLP projector that the camera catches these lines. The color is perfect when I see it. Ah, very nice. Okay, so let me try to play the game with just one hand. Um, okay. That is a big screen. I mean, a big display. Very nice. I cannot feel any lag, even though. I'm using a lot of connections. I still can't feel any lag. This is amazing. Okay, playing with one hand here. You have to see it. I mean, if you guys were in this room right now, you would have seen this. The picture is really big and it's really amazing. I mean, playing old retro games on a projector is really nice. Oh God, run, run, run. Okay. Okay, we're playing in one hand. With one hand is not nice. Okay. So there you go. This was just a quick video about how you can connect your X68000 to a projector and play it on a big wide screen. I hope you guys like this video. And thank you for watching. Bye.